A report by France's High Council for Equality Between Women and Men has unveiled shocking findings regarding online pornography. The report, based on over 18 months of research and the review of millions of videos on major international pornography websites, asserts that as much as 90% of online pornographic content contains verbal, physical, and sexual violence directed at women. Much of this violence is in violation of existing French laws. The report paints a distressing picture of women being depicted in demeaning and dehumanizing ways, often subjected to violence and suffering while being eroticized. It argues that the vast majority of this content contains verbal and physical violence that contravenes French legal standards, with some content even constituting torture. Furthermore, the report disputes the notion of consent within the context of such violent acts, contending that individuals cannot consent to torture, sexual exploitation, or trafficking. It calls for the prosecution of those responsible for producing such pornography and the removal of such content to safeguard the rights and dignity of those depicted. The report strongly criticizes the French state's historical inaction in addressing these issues, particularly in light of decades of lobbying by the pornography industry, which often advocated for freedom of expression. The report condemns the state's blindness and denial in granting the pornography industry what it describes as total impunity. The report also highlights the concerning influence of pornography on young minds, with figures indicating that 51% of 12-year-old boys in France access pornography monthly. It asserts that this widespread consumption of pornography from an early age perpetuates a rape culture. Sylvie Pierre Brassolette, the head of the French Equality Watchdog, emphasized that there is no justification in 2023 for tolerating such illegal acts of torture, especially when they are accessible to minors. She described pornography as a school for sexual violence that must be halted. The report additionally criticizes the inadequacy of the French state platform, Feroz, designed to combat illegal online content, particularly concerning sexual violence. It calls for an expansion of Feroz to address attacks against women within pornography, 